Hey guys, so this is actually a really cool guitar. It's Norm here at the Vintage Guitar Minute. Um, this is a Banner J45. But what makes this so unusual and cool, this is a 1945, but it is maple. If you look in the back, you can see that it's maple. It's not mahogany. And, you know, most of these guitars were made mahogany. It's got a giant neck, sounds great. It's a banner headstock with only Gibson is good enough underneath the script logo. Just really a cool guitar. Um, one of my favorites. And this thing is rare as hen's teeth right now with maple sides and back. So. So this guitar looks like a shrunken guitar or ukulele or tenor guitar, but it's not. It's the Martin smallest size. It's a 518. Size is 518. Has to do with the woods and the trim and all that. Um, mahogany, sides and back, rosewood bridge and fingerboard, tortoise guard. This is a 1952. Sounds and plays great. Really in nice shape. There's a little bit of wear over here on the underside. Um, but just a great little guitar. Um, if you go to Norm's Rare Guitars, our videos, I have the great Grant Geisman who plays a little bit on this guitar and he does uh, El Paso by Marty Robbins. That's, this is the guitar that Marty Robbins made famous and he killed it and then he did some Beatles tunes. Just a great player, so uh, always great to have Grant in here. So this is a 518 and this guitar over here is a 1960 Fender Jazz Master. What's cool about it, it's got the two-tone sunburst, rosewood fingerboard, clay dots, slab neck, and uh, shows some wear, but very nice guitar. Um, this guitar, we refretted it. Um, the frets were low and it was playing, but it's such a nice guitar and it sounds so good. We wanted to put some fresh frets on it to make this thing, you know, play like a dream, and it does. It's got the uh, tremolo arm in there, original brown case. So it's a very nice instrument, 1960 Jazzmaster. Yeah.